Whew. So this what kind of day is gonna be, huh? It's gonna be rainy out here. What's happening with y'all? As you can see, <laughs> cold and rainy day, man, in the city. You feel me? ATL Shawty, you feel me? You feel me? Uh, <laughs> anyway, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Mike Rich, man. What's happening with y'all today? I hope everybody, each and every last one of y'all, is having a blessed day today. And the topic of this video is we made it past that final boss, that FedEx guy. Made it past that FedEx guy. You feel me? Uh, <laughs> got a couple unboxings, y'all. Stay. Stay for both of them, man. Stay for both unboxings. Short video, try to make it like eight minutes, 10 minutes tops, um, and do some first person action. Since it's raining outside, I don't know, I like the rain. I don't know, call me crazy, I like the rain. I don't like being out in it or working in it and nothing like that, but it's something about like, it's just, ugh, get you a nice little hoodie, man, it's kind of cool and rainy, I, I like it, man. It's like the LB Fresher or something, I don't know. Had to dust off that cleansed guy, that cleansed Mike Rich 89 collab. They, they don't make these no more, shout They don't make these no more, man. If you got your one, you got your one. You feel me? Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? But um, let's go ahead and get into these unboxings. I want to come outside while it's, you know, a little dreary out here and get a first-person look at um this unboxing. You got to do all unboxing. I don't care if you've seen the shoe before or not. We made it past the final boss. It's a celebration video. You feel me? So anyway, let's go ahead and get into this unboxing. Two of them. Let's do it. And it is a rainy day today, boy. It's some rain out here, you hear me? In the garage. No cars in the garage, which is senseless, I know. But I was driving this one. Now, wifey was driving that one. And she parked right there. She don't like pulling in the garage sometimes, her big head ass. Uh, I was driving this one. As you can see, it's back then. Anything you see back then, I'm driving it. And uh, my son... He driving that one back there, and um, he pulled in. So it's like, man, I don't know, man. I don't know. It's something about bagging in cars. I just got to do it. Anyway, raining outside, man. Uh, a couple of unboxings. This one right here. Uh, so the regular season is over with college football. And uh, yeah, if y'all can see the blenders, I bought these when uh, Colorado was like on that first two game losing streak. And I was like, I'm riding with Prime, regardless of what. I was peeping the swag, and I messed with Prime. You know what I'm saying? So I had to go in here and get these guys. What's this? It says, welcome to Blenderville. Oh, you got to believe. You got to believe. And um, that's Coach Prime's signature right there. Oof. They are. They literally are, like, marketed as his, his, his joints. I ain't realize that shot these the prime guy then I get. You know what I'm saying? So I wonder, you know, the world moves on hype, bro. So I wonder like if people like after they start losing and stuff like that. I was still around with my guy. I still respected him the same way I respected him before. It was overhyped to begin with, but at the same time, you know, they was they was thriving through the hype. I don't think the hype is what took them away from, you know, what made them start losing games. I think people just figured out. <laughs> How to beat them, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, let's check them out. I'm doing all this with one hand. I'm opening these boxes with these hands. You feel me? I need like some kind of GoPro thing. So anyway, here go the case. Got the blenders, prime joints. You feel me? I think they were like fifty something dollars, sixty dollars or something like that. Anyway, let's check them out. Got to do the, got to do the. Uh, when you hold your plate at Thanksgiving or, or at, a, at a cookout, and you you holding the plate with your legs and all like that. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> yeah, Squeeze got guy together. Uh, so we got, you know, we got sticker. Okay, this is like a real unboxing set. Blenders, we coming. That's another thing Prime be saying. We coming. You know what I'm saying? And all of this is kind of soured a little bit by the fact, the fact that they lost all them games. Prime, you know what I'm saying? Got the dust bag. You know what I'm saying? Then we got the we got the lopes in here. You know what I'm saying? We're going we gonna to do it like that. There you go. There you go. So... We got the prime guy, but hey, you talking about? You know what I'm saying? Y'all see my reflection in there? Sure. I'm going to make every video longer than where they got to be. <laughs> I'm going to talk to y'all, boy. We got the Blenders logo on this side. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And they clean. Let me try them on. See how they look. I can't see it. I got I got the back camera on my phone right now, so 
I don't know. Y'all tell me how they look. They dripping? Are they too they too flashy? Like y'all say, my boy Dion in must be the money. Must be the money. If y'all can remember that, comment below. But uh, yeah, man, the blenders they fit perfect. The sh the the uh, tint is is really nice. Like they like polarized or something. It's like really good tint on them. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I mean with these here, it ain't too dark, but it ain't you know it's just enough to get that sun out your eye. But if, even if they are too flashy, I don't really care about them being too flashy, man. You know what I'm saying? I put me some gold jewelry on, gold watch, man, and go out there and be uh, all gold everything like Trinidad J. He talking about gold all in my frame. He talking about anyway. Y'all uh, comment below if y'all mess with the prime guys. I mess with them heavy, man, and um, they really good quality too, sure. I mean, like, y'all. I mean, he got, he got his signature on the side. I ain't even noticed that. Like you can see his like signature, and like I said, polarized. I was right; they are polarized. I could tell when I put them on. I mess with sunglasses heavy. If y'all ain't new to the channel, got the prime on the ends right here. Y'all see it? Y'all see the vibe? You know what I'm saying? Um, see, say we coming right there. You still ain't found your phone? I did. Okay. Then my son interrupted my video. Say what's happening to the people while you coming through? Hi, man. <laughs> uh, Huh? Some of Those are mine. He gonna ask me if I want some of my own stuff. Look, he got my air fresheners I'm out the car. <laughs> he gonna ask, you doing what? I'm taking two. How you just gonna deep on my air freshener, my boy? I mean, they, they come by two in a pack, so I need one. You got all that meme in the shirt. Uh, he the shot at Mr. Bolden. They hit that hit his line. Shot at Mr. Bolden, man. Yeah. <laughs> <I'm free. laughs> Let's get him out of here. Let's go ahead and do the unboxing, man. This man crazy, man. Put him in one of the cars. He's gonna lay him. Hey, y'all see how he do me? Hey, it be your own people, shot. Wow. It be your own people. So yeah, man. Oh, I ain't say what I had on feet. I mean, I'm just just stepping out the house, man. I had to clean the hoodie on. I was trying to find some purple drip, and I just put on the Air Jordan uh, Seven Low. Um, I can't remember the Concord. I guess purple. I can't remember the name of the. Anyway, and blenders, prime uh, sunglasses. You know what I'm saying? You gotta believe. And them boy, they gonna come back next year, man. I, I I got faith. I believe. You feel me? They gonna come back next year, and they gonna do their thing, man. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to Blender, shout out to Prime. You know what I'm saying? Maybe y'all see this video, y'all can send me some stuff, man. We can do some bidding. the head. Talking about must be the money. Must be the money. Face that. And now for the shoes, man. If anybody, if y'all watched all that and y'all still here, man, I met with y'all heavy. You feel me? So anyway, I'm going to open the box with these hands because I left my knife in the house. So we got to be, you know what I'm saying? We got to have, have problem solving skills, man. You know what I'm saying? It ain't nothing Simple as that, you know what I'm saying? It's easy, it's easy peasy, lemon squeezy, and I beat the uh, final boss, so we finna do it like that, man. Woo final boss beat. Yeah, if you hear me, shout out to whatever fit is driver, driver I got, you actually bought me my shoes. No battle damage on these, now, nah, not that bad. Not bad, got a little, little dent right there. But you know, I ain't really seeing too much battle damage. Not, not, not a whole lot, you know? Yeah, a couple of little small little guys. A little slit right there. That ain't no slit. That's just a crease. Okay, we good. We good. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all see the box. Y'all know what they is. I reviewed this shoe already. I don't know if I realized that the Jumpman was actually outlined, in, you know, between the uh, A's for the Alma um, near A's and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, really insignificant situation. We don't. It don't matter, but... You know what I'm saying? We, it's crazy because I unboxed... Well, I, I, not unboxed, but I reviewed this shoe already. But it's something, something different when you get your own pair, shot. When you get yours for the toe, um, let me look at, let's look at the uh, tag, by the way. Somebody, I went, I went live on Instagram. Somebody said my attention span is ridiculous. I be all over the place. Um, so, Women's Air Jordan 5 Retro SP. Uh, it's a women's size 13 and a half, which equals a men's size 12, which is my size. This shoe is for the toe. Uh, at this point, I don't think I'm going to do it on feet or nothing like that, man. I don't know, because it's, it's been done on YouTube. I don't want to be so... I already feel like I'm being repetitive by unboxing it, but gotta un you got to do all the unboxings on this channel. You got to do all the unboxings. I, Mom, and Nier. Y'all seen all this already. We're going to lay that to the side on this rainy day. <clears throat> For the toe. So I did hit on... Y'all noticed before. Ooh, I don't like that. What they do? What they do? Ooh, I don't like that. Mm, can't really get that off either. Mm, okay, let's let's try not to mess up the moment. I do not like that, Shirley. Oh, 
I don't like that. Anyway, I'm I'm in here. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have to look at the other shoe because I ain't gonna be able to keep looking at that. I'm, that's 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 kind of like, yeah, you know, it might it's pissing me off a little bit. You should cost two hundred twenty five dollars. So anyway, I, I did beat the final boss. I got my shoes. The I'm I'm in here Air Jordan Five. Um, and this is the Dawn colorway. And I just think that's just the way that suede made, man. It got some kind of imp it got like imperfections in that. It's not really suede. It's like a, I want to say durable. And as as you can tell, it's not white. It's really a gray. And you got that leather up there. Like I said, I don't show y'all these shoes before. I don't show y'all how they look. We're gonna be quick. Love this colorway though, man. I keep going back and forth which colorway I like the most, bro. I keep going back and forth because it's just like. I don't know. The black one is hard. But this one is crazy, though. Know? <laughs> these are crazy, man. That gray is sick, these are. See? Not really like, uh, too many imperfections on this shoe. I just seen that one imperfection. Uh, should they have made it a B grade? You know what I'm saying? That one imperfection. Should they have put these in the outlets? <laughs> but, um... You know, little glue action right there, little glue action. But I don't know, man. On feet, you ain't gonna be able to tell none of that stuff. And that one thing, I, I really don't try to get too mad because they make so many pairs of these. Obviously, they made a lot of these, and um, they're not gonna be perfect. They kind of bash produced a little bit, but uh, I try not to get too upset because on feet, ain't nobody gonna really see that on feet. Um, these are hard though. I love the 3D Nike. You know what I'm saying? I throw my blenders, prime shades on with these and just be clean out there in the streets. <laughs> so, anyway, y'all comment below. Let me y'all know what y'all think, man. Um, y'all know what laces I'm going to go with. Like I said, this one for the toe. I'm going with the darker lace. I'm going with that. I thought this was cream, but this is actually white. That's white. And the lace that's in it is that same kind of like, it's the gray. It's the same gray that the shoe that's on the shoe. So I'll probably go with this uh, vintage, like um, vintage dot lace right here. I don't know. That'll make that make these vibes for me if I go with that lace. I don't know. Y'all come along and tell me what y'all think of these guys. Like I said, I'm I made it. You know what I'm saying? Pat that it. I don't ever worry about UPS. My UPS man be on point, show. So I don't ever really worry about UPS too much. But I do worry about FedEx because they have that now they have not stolen any of my sneakers. But they have definitely delivered a lot of stuff to the wrong address. Um, at least two or three of my shoes. Like, and they go to a uh, good thing about it is I got good neighbors that hit me up and be like, we got your shoes. But one day they're going to send this to somebody who ain't going to be that nice. And then I'm, I'm going to be out my shoes. You know what I'm saying? So, FedEx, y'all tighten up, man. Y'all definitely need to tighten up. Got my Amama Near 5s. I got the Dusk colorway supposedly on the way. It took like... Now, like I know a lot of people that's um, waiting on shipping on these. I was worried for a while because it took like six or seven days after I got the the, confirm, the order confirmation to they sent sh uh, shipping information. And it's like I'm five days in after I got the raffle confirmation of, of the uh, dust colorway. So maybe sometime this week I'm thinking that shoe going to ship. Y'all comment below if y'all haven't shipped yet. Y'all hit on the raffle and y'all shoes haven't shipped yet. You know, let your boy know. Anyway, appreciate y'all for watching this video. It was way longer. It was supposed to be like an eight-minute video. It ended up being longer. I don't know. Y'all comment below if y'all don't mind that. And let me give y'all 10 seconds to like this video. If you're still in here and you miss origination, like the video right now. Like the video right now. Hit that notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way yeah, up yeah, yeah. to the moon, to them rainy skies, to the rainy skies on them. And as you saying, keep watching my video because that's what I'm here for. Now we are. Um. Yeah, yeah. Watch me go scoop as a dara. Check out my kiss on the para. Rich like a king of fairy, yeah. Yeah. Captain, they calling me jet like I'm sparrow. East Atlanta in my blood. The streets got me twin like Tia and Mary. Yeah. Watch out with the Camaro. Stay out my lane is too narrow. God more, God more. Stay blessed. I'm keeping my eye on the sparrow. Man of the people you did that sing in my name just like it's a carol. Cause my got the juice by the berry. Yeah. I can't really help it, bro. They know that I'm the ish. Yeah. Catch me boss of sauce and might just pull up right at wish. Yeah. LBRG me. Now I'm Gucci. Gucci. Bricks. But when I step out, 
I don't miss rich. Rich, rich, rich. I just cannot.